All right, welcome back to another video. Today's gonna be a short one right after the holiday. Um, didn't post one on Thanksgiving because Thanksgiving, you know, everyone wants to, you know, be home, enjoy time with their friends. So I let it be, I, you know, didn't wanna post anything. I wanted to enjoy it myself. So we're back at it with a short one. Uh, this one's about the flashlights and the other types of lights that I use while I'm working. Uh, I'm going to start here with my all-time favorite, which is the Matco one. It's a dual light. It goes right over your neck or your head, whichever you want. And it lights up. You can have them one at a time or both. And they both charge via USB, micro USB in this case. You can charge them in the you charge them individually. So if you only use one, you only need to charge one. You can get a good day out of them. They're very good. I like because since you put them on your head, you can have them, you know, pointing at what you want, or you could change their angle. So if you have one in a higher place, you can point one up and just look up without having to really tilt your head very much. Then have the other one pointing at exactly where you're looking. Um, you don't have to get these are expensive because I used to work at the airport and I had these because You know, I use them a lot. So these are expensive, you know, this one's like 50 bucks by itself This one's another like, you know 40. This one was the cheapest one It's about 30. It's from Motorola believe it or not This one has a replaceable battery that you can unscrew here if I remember correctly. Yes, it is And you could just buy the cell by itself uh, this one, all these all charge via USB, by the way, which is perfect. So you don't have to worry about replacing batteries. This one is the only thing I don't like about this one is a little finicky to turn on. So you have to hold it and then press it. But this one has modes. This one is 1100 lumens. It'll actually light up the room I'm recording in by itself. So there's the, the high mode, the medium mode, the low mode. And if you press it twice, you get the strobing effect. And you just hold it to turn it off. This one's very good. It's lightweight. It's very durable. And it's very bright. I like a bright light. Uh, so this one, another one I like is the Mat. This this says Matco Tools, but it's actually made by Streamlight. Is a pen. This is like a little pen light that you can point. It's easy to put in your shirt pocket, in your you know pant pocket, whatnot. And it's very useful because you know sometimes you just need one always on you all the time. In fact, you'll forget that it's even on you from how light it is it's also very durable again uses micro usb to charge this one is a snap-on one this one's magnetic so if i have a piece of magnet here steel here you see it attaches so this one you don't want you know to put near a hard drive or anything that uses magnetic media but if you have it in like the top of a case you could press the button you can have it magnetized to like the top of the case or in a room where you have you know like a like a closet room where you have the, the metal rail up top and then you can have it on its pivot point, shine it wherever you need to shine. This one's very bright, also lasts quite a long time. Also, again, here charges via micro USB. Um, this one is a nice little safety feature that you have to press it twice to turn it off, just in case you accidentally press it and you know you don't didn't mean to turn it off, so that way you don't turn it off. And then this one, one I use for this channel for lighting purposes, you notice the lighting is kind of terrible here today, is the is this snap on one. This one's also magnetic, as you see here at the bottom. There's usually like a, a rubber covering that came off over the years. So this one is a light, as you see, and it tells you how full it is. And this one, this little LED right here, it'll be red when charging and green when it's full. But this one uses USB-C, which is nice. So you can fast charge it a little bit, actually. And my all-time favorite is you can flip it out, and it now becomes a lantern that you could shine on wherever you need to shine and it gives you a whole lot more light. This one will also light up my uh, room, print like this room that I'm recording in pretty well. Um, this one isn't, I, I, I love all of these. I'm actually kind of a flashlight nerd. I like flashlights. They also make a bigger version that's even longer. Uh, these, this one is expensive. This one was about, you know, 150 bucks on the truck, but you know, like to me it was worth it because I'm perpetually blind. The light lasts for, the battery lasts forever. And a lot of these, you get like a, a warranty with them from the truck. If they break, you just go to the truck and get a new one. So yeah, these are these are great lights. I think uh, you don't have to get, you know, the fancy Snap-on or the Matt Coes. You know, you can go to Amazon, buy, you know, 
some generic ones that look like them. Um, but if you do get the like the matte codes or the snap bonds or or whatnot, um, you you're definitely they're a bit on the expensive side, but you definitely will get your money's worth out of it. These are just some of the lights I use. You know, I figured you know other people out there might need to use them. They're perfect. They're more for just working on computers. You could use them for anything. You know, cars, boats, airplanes. You know home improvement, you know, handyman. These are just, you know, examples of what you can use these lights for. But these are my favorite lights, the ones that I use very frequently. And uh, I hope if you are getting into this business, you know, you have at least a guide of what lights are, I think, will be good for you. Thank you very much for watching. I hope you learned something, folks.